Colin asks, can I listen to podcasts and audiobooks? So it's a yeah, good question. Um, you know, because and there's there's a number of them that come up that it's like, oh gosh, you know, it's like this this is reading, this is good good content. Uh, you know, I, uh, with a lot of these like very specific questions, um, you know, part of me is just like, hey, you know, it's like th th there's a spirit here of silence that we're trying to cultivate. Uh, Cardinal Serrano's book, The Power of Silence, talks about how, you know, uh, silence is obviously completely at odds with the freneticism and noise of our time. And mm -hmm. silence is also the foundation of a real prayer life and, and the contemplative life. You know, God is in the silence. That is where he speaks. Um, and it takes effort and work. And it is, Cardinal Serrano says, it is uh, always brutal <laughs> to make the journey into silence when you are used to being so numb by noise. So for me, when I look at this question, it's, it's, um, I would just say like, okay, Hey, like, is this facilitating, you know, a, a greater recollection on a natural and a supernatural level for me? Um, or is this just me numbing things? Cause I'm afraid of silent time. Um, I think we would all say that we could be more silent for me. Even I, this past advent, I was feeling this, this the way, like this was uh, the big part of my ascetic experience over advent this year was, really limiting, you know, the noise, especially at work and in my commutes to work, um, you know, and uh, you never regret, you know, kind of building up um, your capacity for silence. And I would also just say like for fathers, young fathers, like it is just astonishing how children are like, they, 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 they are born in silence and so much of their life is in silence. And for me, I found that very convicting personally, just like I have a capacity to be still. I see it in my kids. I need to grow back into that. And um, I just make that encouragement. It's you're never going to regret that. And um, well, I'm not going to say no to this in every instance. And obviously there's good audio books. It's just books in audio form. I just say like, hey, is this increasing my capacity for silence or is this a distraction?